Hello once again everyone. Welcome back to Shattered Haven. We are going to be going through this bottle now. As I said last episode. I'm doing really good right now. So yeah, um, obviously uh, E3 is sort of on at the moment, and that's a uh, very interesting to me, uh, a lot of gaming news has come out. Uh, I watched some of the uh, Microsoft conference, I managed to catch some of that, and saw some game reviews of from that and it, it's got some good games um, I mean some of it's not so good like the always on well the 24 hour mandatory checkup that your system is connected online is not the best because not everyone has internet but you know it's Maybe you shouldn't do it, but you know. And then the uh, thing that I was, was really worried about, but it's slightly less bad than what it seems is the. such of a problem for me because I usually just collect my games I don't really sell them on but or lend them to many people and but it, you can share with your family which is good because uh, I don't really know if my brothers are really gonna be bothered about the Xbox one to be honest because they're not really bothered about gaming as much as me but yeah but it's, it's sort of good that you can share it with your family or and all that on the same Xbox or an Xbox system link sort of thing as so this and that but 
but yeah. I definitely think uh, from looking at the Xbox reveal games, it's got a couple good games coming out soon. Um, I mean, it started off with uh, uh, Metal Gear Solid, which is pretty cool. I mean, I'm not, I've never been into Metal Gear series, but you know, that's pretty cool. And it's purple, that's not the purple door. Yeah, a new Halo game really pumped me up for the Xbox One system. Obviously, I'm gonna get it. I'm not gonna probably get it on the release day. It's not like oh, when it first comes out. It's not that. So for me, the game, well, the games coming out for it are cool, but you know. Halo, it'll be like when Halo comes out for me, and there's several of games like I would rather get like uh, Watch Dogs on it maybe than the on the Xbox because of the better system sort of thing, better graphics and all that sort of stuff. So some new games like um, the new Forza looks pretty good. Oh, like graphically, where am I? Mirror's Edge, which is pretty tasty. Battlefield 4, I mean I've never been into Battlefield, but that's pretty, pretty back and hiding.
this is also exciting um, uh, as well as the uh, Elder Scrolls Online. excited about uh, Battlefront, not Battlefield, people may make, make, make Battlefield and make a Battlefront 3, but yeah. I'm really enjoying Gratuia, it's actually it's a very good game. Ladder. Ah, 
hammer, we should be able to do something. Right? down doors with hammers. There's no portal. But I'm pretty sure there's other places we can explore. I've been in that house. Probably in this one, but So yeah, uh, but uh, as with racing, most racing games, it gets a bit samey race after race after race. But yeah, still. It's okay. The, the drifting stuff is pretty, pretty bang tidy. It's a spider in there now. It's got some interesting gameplay elements at least that keep me amused. Water balloon.
Damn them rats. So I would recommend it. I mean, it, may, it might get boring after a while, and I might move on to a different game. But yeah, still pretty. kill you. I will do this. I think I'll just do 
this level and call it quits. And then, yeah. Um, I've also been watching Heroes, and that's always enjoyable. I've got uh, well, four more episodes to go before season one's finished. So not long at all. closing up I'll be and it's annoying so yeah I'll see you guys uh, next time peace out Girl Scouts